bit of a rough Suicune to deal with. He, he's coming up. Now, I, th I think he played both Suicune and Aegis Slash against Sir Spud, and I think that's what got him. And Sir Spud was playing uh, Scizor as well against him. I think yeah. that might have hurt quite a bit. But he's going he's Gengar He's solid Caesar. I've played his. Oh, it's definitely um, solid, but definitely I don't think it's up to par with Gengar, for sure. I think it's just a matter of mindset. Definitely. Um, here. Right. Spud making his way in with that JX, Shadow mm -hmm. Ball and Sludge Bomb. Getting that attack down. Now, I'm not sure if Falco actually has played against Sir Spud before, at least in a, in a tournament like this. So, she might be getting, may be getting a hard wake up about Gengar here. Ooh, and that ambiguous mix up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think. I, I, th I feel like Sir Spud's just going to be able to get away with a lot of stuff here. I think just. I oh. mean, movement, yeah. As a character who's, and a player who's based heavily uh, on a set play kind of style, yeah, yeah. he's definitely going to get away with a lot of murder. Yeah, it looks like, that, that, that was a perfect, I believe. So, yeah, Falco definitely might be getting a hard wake-up call here against Sir Spun. Right. And grab not working out there. Getting a Shadow Ball sent up. Big damage coming here. Oh, man. Nice, there. Building up that synergy so nice. Our knockdown, Shadow Punch. And Falco is really in a bad position right now. See, that's smart. Using mm -hmm. that, um, I believe that's forward Y to cover that homing attack and the uh, charge homing. Yeah, I, th I, th I think that's what it was. Yeah, I think Falco might uh, be uh, getting, uh, getting, getting the, the big Gengar treatment right now. <laughs> Definitely uh, looking a little bit rough for her at this moment. She is doing a change. I doubt we're getting anything other than Situac, because that's the only character she really plays. But I think something that helps her with her range is going to help out a lot. Or to just make some crazy plays. Get, get into his head by doing the thing he least yeah. expects. I will say, that is really hard to do against Sir Squad, though. He's very... He can be just really cautious and just... I have a really good idea how to get into your own head. Now, she is running Rotom, which I can see like why she think that, like he's in the air a lot, but the thing is, Gengar has a lot of way counterplay to Rotom, because he has the, um... Shadow Sneak? Yeah, the Shadow Sneak that can disappear in the air, Now I can just completely avoid Rotom, so she might be figuring that out here really soon. Yeah, so Sir just going absolutely aggressive here, which is not usually something you see. Catching that shield drop with the JX. No Oki grab though. Bad oh. spot to press buttons. Gets the air combo. I don't quite finish it though. Didn't quite see ADC to do that. That was swift. Yeah, that was, that was nice. Falco using her 6x. It's a very powerful tool in this matchup because it'll be out, I think, a lot of uh, Gengar's normals. And I know for sure it'll be out Shadow Ball. Okay, so. And so by taking that first round. Looking pretty good on his burst so far. Telekis, I can definitely agree with more. I think really helping with your mobility can really help out. Mm -hmm. Spirit Shock, or uh, Falco being more curious with her uh, movement and cautious. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. I like how she's just not going straight forward. Like, she's trying to like, test the water, like, bait out something. I can appreciate that. Slunt Bomb set that defense down. Catching her jumping over with that Astonish. Got full combo. Uh, yeah, lots here. of damage going on. Falco does have her burst, so she's been sitting on it. I really think she needs to pop, start popping that here pretty soon. Yeah. Kiss. And just going straight forward, pushing him into the corner. That was a nice cancel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but she, she's really using that 5x to the Ghost Dash cancel. I really, really like that. Just right. puts her in a safe position. Bursting out of that Oki position. Oh, I can't quite finish her off, though. Against Frog Deer. This one even still has his own burst if he really needs it. Oh, nice AY, able to snag that. A quick victory for Sir Spud. I think he really wants to make this loser's run happen. Right. And that was a very, very quick set there.